So right now I am Santa and I have to collect all the stuff that was in my um, sleigh because a banker has destroyed the sleigh because bankers like to ruin Christmas. Do you see how this is working? I don't know why a banker was particularly, oh there's a bad guy, uh, particularly upset with Santa or the concept of giving things, well that's probably because he was a banker. So uh, as Santa I have to run around and get all the stuff and not touch the zombie businessman because that will end the game. Live and learn. So we'll try that again. How many lives have I got? Oh, unlimited. Brilliant. Probably going to need them. Um, it's looking a bit shaky in the video, but it's looking a bit shaky for me too. That's how I know it's looking shaky in the video. Do you see? Uh, okay. It's not, I'm not, you know, I'm not gripped. Oh, there's a bad guy. Can I jump on top of something to get away from him? Because as you know, Christmas is the time for, I'm, I'm guessing he's supposed to be a zombie. Yeah, or a sleepwalker. I think we've all seen horror movies about sleepwalkers. At least the controls are simple. Because as you know, I'm not that great with complicated controls. Can I, oh wow, this is running really badly. It shouldn't, because it's not that complicated. Anyway, since I have quite a lot of brain power to talk about other stuff, because this is not taxing me, although I am probably just about to die again. We'll see. Yep. So this is actually quite a challenge, getting past the zombie sleeping guy, zombie sleeping businessman. Maybe he's the banker. I only know the backstory because I read it on the website. It's from Big Fish Games. Um, it's not actually come up in the, in the game. I just stopped myself from saying actual again then. But then I said it anyway, so. There we go. Eventually. Okay. I don't know when this came out, but it's graphically a little bit, um... Well, you know how sometimes simple graphics can be really charming? I just find these to be... Oh, there's a dog. I just find these to be a bit nothingy and considering how simple the graphics are it should be running like a dream and it just isn't and it's very slow paced and I'm having a big whinge about it because um well you know because I can because I'm here to have a big whinge I'm guessing that's a bad guy although I don't quite know what it's supposed to be but it looks evil maybe it's a house elf it's Dobby the house elf he's gone bad look and he's gone into dancing. Oh wow, sluggish. So yeah, anyway, you know, my Christmas shopping is about done. I'm gonna do some more tomorrow and then, I, and then I'm good. Do I have to get everything? Cause I kinda don't really wanna go back and do all this again. Because I'm bored. So we'll just go down there and then we'll find all the stars. I've got 67 points. That's amazing. Oh look, an Xbox game console. That's how you say it in Australia. Console. Oh, there's a dog. Big whoop de doo. I'm sorry. I'm just I'm not this is not making me feel festive. It's making me feel bored. Do you know what this is? This is like one of those movies that you watch because it's Christmas and you know you probably is the turkey a bad guy? Why is the turkey, why is the turkey plucked, is my question to you. And you can't even answer it because you're not here. Anyway, you know how sometimes there's movies on at Christmas and you think, well, they can't be that bad. Although last year I did watch Christmas shoes, so nothing is as bad as that. Uh, but, and you sort of, you end up, and you're watching it and you realise it's terrible. Oh man. Uh, you realise it's terrible. Uh, but you can't stop watching it because now you're invested in the time and everything and it's Christmas So maybe it'll get better. Oh wait, I've got a time limit. Oh If I'd known that oh Man, I have to go back and get all the gifts on my little tiny Santa feet Wow This game sucks Anyway, it's like those yeah like those movies and you, you sort of think well Maybe it'll make me feel a bit festive, and it just doesn't, because it's bad. I mean, this the plot of this is 
pointless and it just it's just badly animated you know I'm, I'm sorry to the game designer if you're watching this because I know you've probably put in a lot of hard work but I kind of knew it was going to be terrible because it's only got two stars on the reviews so you know it's kind of a hint isn't it there is a time limit wow I hope I can eventually get past that guy how did I do it last time this whole video is just going to be this one level. So I hope you really like it because you're going to see a lot of it. That's a sad little Christmas tree. I probably don't have time to stand around and make a commentary on everything that I'm seeing. But I think we all know that I'm going to fail this level anyway. So it's kind of okay. Did I just land on like nothing? Can I jump over him from there? Nope. And also, I don't know how many gifts I actually need to complete the need. I don't know why I said it like that. Uh, I don't know how many gifts I need to complete the level. There's no sort of indication that... Of how many, and are the stars gifts or are they just stars? Oh, this game is throwing up a lot of questions. I don't want to die again. But I did. Alright. Well, of course not die because I'm sad. But look how small my feet are. No wonder I can't jump very high. I have tiny little Santa feet. Does Santa have small feet? He's supposed to be an elf of some kind, I believe. Must be true. Written on the internet. And, uh... So I would assume that he would have kind of tiny little Santa feet. There we go. Yes? Okay. How many gifts do I need? I don't know. Why can I only jump on the caravan from that side and not from the other side? I don't know. I've got nothing more to say to you about this game. I don't know if the stars are gifts. I don't know if I should be collecting stars or not. I'm just going to do it because you only oh you only live once. YOLO. I'm going to collect all of Santa's stars. YOLO. Uh, and uh, the kids I work with don't haven't grasped y uh, YOLO yet. They kind of they're. They're excited about the concept of YOLO, but they don't really know when to apply it. So it's like I'm having toast, YOLO. I'm worried that the stars are parts of the present, so I'm going to go back and get those. And we'll go up there. I keep sort of randomly, apparently I keep sort of randomly landing on bits of landscape. So I need to get that, probably. So... But then there's that guy. So what if we go like that and then go over here? See? Strategy. How did I get onto the truck in the first place without touching the guy? Oh, I did it like that. So we'll get those off the roof. Wow. See, my computer's not high-end. But it should be high-end enough to run this. You'd think. It can run World of Warcraft. I wish there was, I just, I want a gift countdown so that I know if 50 seconds from now I am going to, oh, get the dog out of here. If, uh, am I going to, 41 seconds, I don't know if I'm going to pass or not. This is terrible. The tension is just killing me. It's not really, because I don't care. I don't care. This is a bad game and it should feel bad about itself. I've only been playing it for, what, about nine minutes. It feels like forever. Oh, come on. Oh, I've completed the level. How many gifts did I need? I don't know. I got 121 points, though. So now we go to this next level, which looks much the same as the first level. So exciting. And I need that. I need that cracker. I understand that in America the crackers are not so much a thing. Christmas crackers, I mean. Not like a racial uh, thingy. I'm just saying Christmas crackers. Bonbons. They're not really bonbons though, are they? Because those are chocolates. Yep. I don't know where that guy's going. 
I want him to turn around so that I can jump over him. Anyway, speaking of Christmas crackers, because I've always got like a really bad joke inside. I just jumped off the sky. Can I double jump? No? Okay. Just poor level design then. Uh, I already think because uh, Christmas crackers always have a paper hat and a small prize and a terrible joke. And the jokes are always ter I mean, they're woeful. They're terrible. And I already think that they are deliberately bad because not everybody shares a sense of humour. And a joke that you find hysterically funny, somebody else might not even get, you know. Because some of your relatives, you know, not so sharp. Um, so the jokes are deliberately really obvious and bad so that everyone groans and feels united and sort of warm and fuzzy and like they're with their family and having a lovely time. Because they're all getting along and agreeing that that joke was terrible. I can't remember my joke from last year. I was going to keep it forever because it was great. Was that a remote control car? Cool gift. Just a little hang, a little bit of air time there. Now if I jump there, will I get hit in the head with a dobby? No. I can't get those, I don't want them. That thing's there, whatever it is. Evil elf. Jump the dog. Wow, I really did jump the dog. I am an amazing Santa. There's nothing in the instructions, by the way, to tell me how many points I need to get. Is that the Griswold's car? Um, so I don't know. The instructions basically just told me use the arrow keys and the space bar to jump, which kind of works eventually. Which is probably why I keep dying. So I don't know, I don't know what the minimum is. I don't know why Santa is, I suppose those are the letters to Santa. Yeah. Oh man. Usually when the videos are this jittery, it's because of my recording software. In this case, I can guarantee I am seeing the exact same jitters. Wow. The Grinch is not wearing any pants this year. Way to ruin Christmas. Oh wait, that's the whole point of the Grinch. Well done. Good planning. Oh, I don't want to collect more gifts. I don't want to complete this level. I want Christmas to be ruined, basically. That's what I'm saying. So, it's just gonna, I'm just going to game over at this point. Oh, I've got 20 seconds. I might be able to skip around on my little feet. I don't think I get points for the stars. Do I not get points for the stars? No. Oh, hey, I do. This is so exciting. Okay, one more level. And then I'm going to go and do something productive with my life. Oh, look, we're out of the, um, we're out of the, what do you call them? Trailer parks. Call them caravan parks in Australia. Because we call trailers caravans. See, not only am I mildly entertaining, and I say that because somebody once told me I was mildly entertaining, not wanting to blow my own trumpet, because I don't have a trumpet. Uh, I do have a ukulele, but I can't play it. Anyway, where was I? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we call them caravans, and they're caravan parks. Do you see? So I am educational, as well as entertaining. And... I bought a Christmas card today for the Reddit card exchange, and it had snow on it. But... Because yeah, all our, not all our cards have snow on them, but we have a lot, quite a lot of cards with snow on them, even though it's summer. But it also uh, played the chicken dance, so I really couldn't resist it. The chicken had a Santa hat, and then when you open it, it plays the chicken dance. I've just run out of stuff to say. I'm, this is sapping my will to game. Oh, look at that massive Christmas tree floating. That was worth, I think, two points. Wow. Santa doesn't really have a great variety of gifts for giving to people. You know, all my festive spirits just being sapped now. I know I'm, I know I'm whinging, but come on. The developer must have known this was going out in public. What would his mother say? Or her mother. I don't know who developed it. And I don't care to know. Oh, I just keep randomly stopping. Come on, Sand, a little bit of a little bit of hustle up here, mate. Uh, here we go. Why is Sand delivering sandwiches for Christmas? I don't know. Is that 
the end and there's not enough gifts to collect. Wow, okay, we'll try again. I've still got 37 seconds. What is that thing? Yeah, I know, I heard you the first six times. Wow, pushy. I think I might go hug the Grinch. I think it's time to end this. Hug the Grinch, hug the Grinch. There we go, hug the Grinch. This this game's, um, I, I don't want to play this anymore, so I'm, at, <laughs> I'm just going to stop now. Um, yeah, like 15 minutes ago, I was, I was full of festive joy and seasonal goodwill, and it's all just gone. It's just gone. I'm going to go and watch the Christmas shoes again. <laughs>